Williams goes right corner to Dubois. Tightly guarded by Douglas, finds Ireland on left wing, fakes the pass, drives, bounce pass the loss, and this time Quincy finishes! Well, one of them, James Douglas, leading scorer, has multiple fans in attendance here tonight. But Egbayami answers back for the Lions with three of his own. 16-26 to play, Lawson swings it to Dubois, sends the beat, three ball on the way, and good! Jared Dubois dials long distance and connects. Dubois works the right baseline, touch pass to Lawson, fill in the paint, finger rolls it home with the right hand. 14-9, the Lions up by five. Dubois, step back jumper from the free throw line is good. Break for Loyola Marymount, 16-9. Lions with the advantage, Lawson goes to Egg Miami, dials it up from long distance and converts! Who's gonna make the next big shot for the Lions? Right to the rack, Okaji finishes on the reverse. Lions can thank their lucky stars. That didn't fall because he was wide open, three ball. Laurent Armstead is good! They've been now playing significantly since the 13-minute mark of the first half. Ron Armstead hits a cutting Okaji. Who scores it? Beautiful gourmet quality dish inside by Armstead for Northern Arizona as Ireland splits the defense. Dishes off to Okaji. Look out below. A little leftover stuffing served up by Okaji. With 12 seconds to shoot, Ireland to Lawson. Runner with the right hand is good. A little soap bubble by Lawson with Douglas. Up top to Dubois. Dubois to his right. Feeds the post. Down low. Okaji spins and scores. Ireland. Three ball on the way. In and out. No good. But no! Oh, there's Lawson. The one hand rebound and the flush. Ron Armstead going to try to answer the three of his own and that's good. Suddenly a downpour of threes here from Albert Gerson Pavilion. One of the stars of tonight's ball game, Quincy Lawson. Quincy, a career high 10 points. You were five of seven from the field. Talk for us about your performance tonight. You had a lot of opportunities to score the basketball and you sure, uh, sure took advantage of it. Yeah, tonight they were focusing more on Anthony, trying to stop him. And I think as a team, we made up for it. Everyone was in double figures for the most part. So we just try to team effort to get the scoring on the board. So we talked about the scoring. You mentioned the team effort, and I think that's a great storyline as well because you look at your stat line, didn't just have the 10 points, you had five rebounds, you also had three assists. The team had 21 helpers all together. Is that something that Max Good and company worked on with the team in, uh, in practice because we saw a lot of extra passes, a lot of great ball movement, was really crisp and clean, and the assist total really bears that out. Yes, definitely. We we focused on more moving the ball. I think we did that really well tonight. We're moving the ball, getting assists, everyone's touching it, getting good shots. So take us into the huddle in the first half. The Lions had been up by 10 points. Northern Arizona went on a 12 to nothing run, took their first lead since early in the ball game, but then the Lions finished with a flourish. What were some of the adjustments, adjustments that Max Good made in the huddle because it looked, Lions looked like a different team the final five minutes of the first half. We had to get more focused, focus more on rebounding, continuing to move the ball instead of taking bad shots. I think we did that pretty well. So Tuesday night, the Lions back in action against a very good St. Louis Billiken club. We mentioned on the broadcast to the casual fan, they may not realize you know, how good that team is. They've already beaten Washington, Boston College, and Villanova. Talk for us about how important a team effort like we saw tonight will be on Tuesday against St. Louis. It's very important. As for us, we just have to continue to work as a team, moving the ball, rebounding is really important too. And I, I feel if we play as hard as we really should, we'll be successful. Last question for you, Quincy. We've got some of your friends and family, uh, not just in attendance, but we know tuning in on the Lions Audio Network, probably watching our uh, simulcast over the web right now. What do you want to say to your friends and family that uh, tuned in to, to hear your performance tonight, your career-high 10 points against the Lumberjacks? Uh, just thank you for watching. Keep supporting us. We're going to keep working hard. So, Quincy, congratulations. Enjoy this one. I know no rest for the weary. You've got a couple of days to prepare for St. Louis and be back at it on Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Happy Thanksgiving to you and the entire team, and look forward to catching up with you again on Tuesday night. All right. Thank you. You too.